hi everyone in this video we are going to see about determination of oxygen coefficient which is also known as k of la by sodium sulfate oxidation method aim to determine the volumetric oxygen co coefficient k of la by sodium sulfate oxidation method principle during the aerobic process oxygen is one of the most important key substrate due to its less solubility with the culture media there is a supply of continuous supply of oxygen is required in the fermenter for effective growth the oxygen transfer rate or also known as otr must be predicted to achieve an optimum design and scale up process of bioreactors the dissolved oxygen concentration in a culture broth depends on the rate of oxygen transfer from the gas to liquid phase the gas liquid mass transfer in a bioprocess is depends on the hydrodynamic conditions in the bioreactors oxygen transfer is the most important rate limiting steps in the aerobic process the accurate prediction of volumetric mass transfer coefficient k of la is an important consideration in design operation and scale up of industrial bioreactors sodium sulfate oxidation method is based on the sodium sulfate a reducing agent with the help of dissolved oxygen to produce sulfate in the occurrence of a divalent cation of copper or cobalt copper et al 1944 sodium sulfate in a2so3 combines with oxygen to give na2so4 sodium sulfate with the copper sulfate cuso4 as a catalyst in the reactor the concentration of na2so3 sodium sulfate at various time points is inversely proportional to oxygen transport rate kinetics of the above reaction is independent of sulfate concentration the reaction consumes oxygen at a rate that is sufficiently fast so that transport of oxygen from gas to liquid through liquid film is the rate limiting step of a reaction rate of reaction is zero order if the reaction is not fast enough reaction occurs in the liquid liquid film around the gas film bubbles this would decrease apparent film thickness and gives incorrect high value of oxygen coefficient otherwise known as k of la concentration of unreacted sulfate are determined by reacting sulfate with excess iodine that is i2 and then back titration of iodine to with thiosulfate it is important to note that dissolved oxygen o2 is a no is zero throughout the reaction reaction so3 2 minus plus i2 gives 2i minus plus so2 s2 o7 plus i2 gives 2i minus plus so2 o2 star minus o2 concentration of o2 is zero concentration of o2 star equal to 8.43 into 10 to the power minus 3 gram per liter oxygen transfer rate otr equal to moles of oxygen into 32 divided by time into volume of reactor materials required 0.1 molarity of na2 so so3 sodium sulfide 0.003 molar copper sulfate and hydrogen and water molecule c2so4.5 h2o standard na2so3 standard sodium sulfide 0.1 ml of iodine solution which is i2 solution and 1 percentage of starch solution procedure first step 1 liter of 0.5 molar sodium sulfate na2so3 solution is prepared second step the sodium sulfate solution is poured into fermenter which consists of 0.003 molar copper sulfate and water solution third step supply of oxygen and agitation was given at 300 rpm collect the samples from the fermenter for every 5 minutes fourth step sodium sulfate concentration was estimated by titration against the iodine solution titration first burette solution is 0.1 one molar sodium sulfate solution flask solution 1 ml of sodium sulfate solution plus 30 ml of iodine solution plus 100 microliter mul of starch solution during titration color change to straw yellow concentration of sodium sulfate in in sample was estimated from the standard curve then the consumption of oxygen concentration was estimated now we can see about the result first we have to make some table in table 1 we can take titrated value of na2so3 s2o3 against the various concentration of na2so3 concentration of na2so3 in molarity and volume of na2s2o3 in 
milliliter for 0.2 molar volume of NaTO SO3 is 12 ml for 0.3 it is 12.3 0.4 it is 9.7 ml 0.5 m it is 8.3 ml 0.6 m it is 7.2 ml and then we can go for table 2 calculation of KLA value with respect to time we have time in seconds volume of Na2H2O3 in ml molarity in molar oxygen transfer rate in gram in GH R power minus 1 L power minus 1 and then we can finally calculate the value of oxygen coefficient KLA is equal to OTR divided by 8.43 into 10 to the power minus 3 so first in 5 seconds of time the volume of N Na2H2O3 will be 7.6 in 0.56 molarity OTR will be 107.52 when calculating the value we can get 1275.4 in 10 seconds the volume of N2 is to Na2H2O3 will be 8 molarity is reduced to 0.53 oxygen transfer rate is also decreased to 50.88 and oxygen oxygen coefficient will be increased to 6035.58 and then in 15 seconds again the volume is increased to 9.5 ml and molarity is decreased to 4 Oxygen transfer rate is also again halfly decreased, nearly half decreased to 25.6. Also, oxygen coefficient value is also decreased to nearly half, which is 30,000. Sorry, 3,036.77. And then in 20 seconds of time, volume is again increased to 10.1 ml. Molarity is decreased to 0.35. Oxygen transfer rate is also decreased to 16.8. Oxygen coefficient is again decreased to 1992.88. To clear the conclusion in table 2, we have chose to solve the first serial number which is at time 5 seconds and 5 seconds is converted into hour as 0.0833 hours and then volume of Na2 is of is 203 is taken as 7.6 ml molarity predicting by plot graph is 0.56 oxygen transfer rate formula is moles of oxygen into 32 divided by time into volume of reactor so while calculating this we can have the answer as 0.56 into 32 divided by 0.0833 into volume of reactor 2 which is equal to 107.52 OTR and OTR divided by 8.43 into 10 to the power minus 3 is oxygen co oxygen supply coefficient which is KLA KLA at 5 seconds is calculated as 1275.4 gram per liter so KLA value of the reactor is 3085.15 gram per H, H inverse so now the final result we get as sodium sulfate oxidation method of measuring KLA volumetric oxygen coefficient of the reactor was found to be 3085.15 gram per H inverse. And finally I hearly thank every one of you from bottom of my heart for your kind and patient listening and thanks for cooperating with us. This video is created by our team team I. Myself Gautam Raj and my friends Tachana Murthy S, Gopi Manishankar M and Suresh K. Thank you for your efforts and cooperation with me guys. Thank you.